Okay, so here's a very short screencast to show you something I built. I call it the Valve Rules. Uh, when uh, coding for rules, you oftentimes, well, at least I oftentimes, uh, find myself digging around for different data types and things. And I thought I would like to solve these um, issues once and for all, so I created a new module. It's called the Valve Rules. It's a sandbox right now, so it's right now it's called 1483426, but I call it Devel Rules. You'll find it in development, and it requires uh, the Devel module, the rule, <coughs> rules admin module enabled as well, and then their dependencies. And they give you the following. Um, a new tab over at the uh, rules admin page, that's called rules uh, Devel info, and you have a number of sub tabs here. Data types, you can view all the data types known to rules, so you can see what they are, and you can also dig into them and and uh, get some more information like this. And you have entity properties, all the entities known to the site, uh, and, well, uh, and their properties. And you also get the global, the pseudo entity site here that contains the uh, uh, well, globally available stuff for rules. You can view all the actions uh, on the site. You can view all the conditions known to rules, things like that. Uh, also events. Uh, you can just browse and and uh, see how how they work and what what kind of variables and and things they use. Uh, I also I'm not sure about this, but I added a tab here for components. I'm not sure that this is a good thing, but uh, it might be. Who knows? Um, yeah. If I'm really lucky, I get this pushed into the rules project, uh, but I'm not sure. We'll see what happens with this. Uh, if you find this useful, please uh, write a comment or something, and I'll uh, get some more energy to work with this. Yeah, see you. Bye.